Hi everyone! So today I'm going to unbox a refrigerator from Toshiba model GRRT624WE PMY06. So let's unbox this. Thank you. This is warranty card and owner's manual. Model GRR-T624WE PMY06 and 12 years warranty for compressor and generally one year warranty. Okay, that is origin inverter which is consists of compressor inverter, fan inverter and what is it for? To save energy and now look at this it is certified by Surhan Jaya Tenaga and five star which is the best among the best see this fridge is not balanced For ventilation, you need at least 10 cm surrounding and for top, you need at least 30 cm. Spare enough space for the convenience of opening the door and drawers of the fridge. Oh, no, 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 I cannot turn this on yet because I have to leave this refrigerator for two hours for the compressor oil to stabilize. So it's been two hours and I can turn this switch on. But still I cannot put my ice cream eggs my veggie because I have to wait for two or three hours for the fridge to cool down. So now let's go through how to use this lovely fridge from Toshiba GRRT624WE PMY06. Come follow me. First operation button. Temperature setting button of refrigerator compartment. Two, control panel. Setting one, cold. Setting two, mid. Setting three, colder. Setting four, super cool. Number three, display. When electrify the refrigerator for first time, all keys on the display light up fully for three seconds, and then the refrigerator runs according to setting three. In case of a failure, the corresponding LED blinks. Indicator setting 1 and setting 2. Temperature sensor failure of refrigerating chamber. Indicator setting 1 and setting 3. Defrost sensor failure of freezer chamber. Indicator setting 1 and setting 4. Ambient temperature sensor. So now finally I can put my food inside this 530 liter fridge from Toshiba. GRRT624WE PMY06. Let's see how much 530 liter fridge can store. Okay, first part is freezer chamber. Okay, for this part, I put my sausages, spaghetti bolognese, Hawaiian pizza. Okay, this part more to fast food and this place that we can uh, keep our food for longer term. Okay, next part we move to refrigerator chamber. Okay, the first part is cooling zone where I put my meat and seafood here. Okay, this part can uh, last up to until seven days of freshness. 
Okay. Okay, let's see. I put my meat here and because of the texture is so soft and easy to cut. Okay. Next, I move to adjustable shelf where I put my vitamin drink here, bottle mineral bottle water drink, and then mineral water, fruits. Okay, the bottom part is vegetable and fruits box where I store my vegetable and fruits. As you can see, there's carrot, a mushroom. Okay, next we move to my favorite part, which is utility box where I can store my skincare here. As you can see, this is my face mask, and yes, this is my favorite part. Okay, and then okay, uh, we move to. Uh, adjustable door rack right? where so I put my eggs here, then jam, sauces, soft drink, yogurt, milk, and now you will see how much 530 liter fridge can store. I am so so happy to have this in my house. Adjustable shelf. The shelf are adjustable to your preference. Adjustable door racks. Right? By changing or removing the position of the door racks, it can flexibly store big and small items according to your needs. So now, this is the part that I love the most, utility box, where I can put my skincare and cosmetics here. It has unique high bottle design that satisfies the storage of large bottles of cosmetics. I believe it's easy for you to use this fridge from Toshiba GRRT624WE PMY06. I'm very happy. Let's see the functions of Toshiba GRRT624WE PMY06. In conventional fridge, the air usually comes from the back and create an even cooling. But with Toshiba, it has air for cooling system with four holes and the air will fall to the front of the fridge including the air from the back which is make this part much more cooler. Okay, this keep the food fresh much much longer. Ugh. Luckily, I still have Pure Bio. It smells so fresh. The next function is Origin Inverter, which is consists of compressor inverter and fence inverter. What do they do? They save energy by 17%. It is certified by Surhanjaya Tenaga, and they give 5 stars for the yearly consumption 350 kilowatt, which is equivalent to less than 10 ringgit per month. Next function is cooling zone and let's see how it works. Okay, this is cooling zones like soft freezing that we can store meat or seafood and keep it fresh uh, for 7 days. And now I'm going to show you the meat from cooling zone. It is so soft and easy to cut but now I'm going to take it the meat from freezer. And see. It is so hard and tough. And now I'm going to show you the texture, yeah. This is from the freezer and this one from the cooling zone. All right? You see the different, and we start with from the freezer first. Okay, see how hot it is. So hot! Oh my god! So now, from the cooling zone, I'm going to show you how soft it is. And see, it is easy to cut. So soft. You see? Ah. So now that's the difference uh, the meat from soft uh, freezing and freezer. Okay, that is why I love cooling zone function so so much. 
Okay, the next function is humidity box. In humidity box, we can store a vegetable or fruits and it will keep the vegetable and fruit uh, fresh and moist. So, now let's see. Okay, now we go to the humidity box. Okay, now here is the button for vegetable and fruits. And uh, if you want to keep vegetable in here, just uh, push the button to the vegetable or fruits. Just push the button to fruits because fruits need more air to keep it moist. Okay, so now I'm going to show you tomatoes that I put in this humidity box and tomatoes that I put in ordinary place. Okay, so now let's see. So okay now, I'm going to show you the difference of these tomatoes that I put in humidity box and this uh, I put in room temperature. So now I take out this first from humidity box and now and this from room temperature place. So now you can see the difference. These tomatoes, okay, this looks so fresh and moist, but this look like not really fresh and moist. So this is why I love Toshiba fridge so so much. This is my favorite ice box because of why? Just one press and the ice will fall into the container. That's it. I can enjoy my ice Milo now. The last function is LED lights. There are three LED lights in this fridge. So let's see where is the LED lights. Okay, first it is here. Can you see how bright it is and it's easy for me to find my food. One more thing, it doesn't hurt my eyes. And now let's find another two. And uh -huh. One is here and another one is here. So, so overall, can you see how bright it is and it's easy for me to find my food. And this is why I love Toshiba GRRT624 WE PMY06 so much. So now to clean your fridge, let's go. Remove expired foods. If you have recalled food item in your refrigerator, it's important to throw out the food and clean your refrigerator. Germs in the recalled food could spread to drawers or shelves in your refrigerator. Items will need sealed bags, hot soapy water, and clean towels. Number one, throw out the recall food and any other foods. Store, beat it or touching it. Put it in a sealed bag in the garbage. Number two, empty the rest of the items in your refrigerator and put them on a counter or table while you clean. Take out shelving, drawers and any other removable parts. Number three, wipe the inside of the empty refrigerator with hot soapy water, then wipe with clean water to rinse off soap. Dry with a clean towel. Number four, put the shelves, drawers, and other removable parts back in the refrigerator along with the other items you took out. Isn't your fridge clean now? Now, I'm going to tell you about the storage tips and care. Number one, do not put hot leftovers in the fridge because the texture of the food will change and I believe you will not like it. Number two, please cover the food before you put in the fridge. You know why? Because bacteria will grow and your food will turn bad. 
Number three, never, never, never mix your fruits and vegetables in the same crisper because of the fruits produce oxidized gas and your vegetable will turn wilted and you know will be not fresh. Number four, please do not overstock and overcrowd the food in your fridge. This is because it will create warm spots and the cold air will not flow efficiently. Number five, please move your food from the back to the front before the food expires. So simply, you have to eat your older food before you eat your new food. Just like me, I always forget about the food from the back and it will become expired. What a waste! Number six, please wipe spills in your fridge because to keep your fridge clean and tidy. And you also don't like it when your fridge is dirty, right? Number seven, please, please remove expired foods in your fridge. And you know why? If you keep expired foods in your fridge, it will create smell and the bacteria will contaminate to other food. Next is tips number eight and number nine. They are similar, so for number eight, Please store your raw meat and fish in a proper container because when it frosts, it will cover the fish and the meat and you will not recognize which is which. So for number 9, please organize and label your food so it's easy for you to recognize and to take the food out. Check the dough gasket regularly to make sure there are no debris. The interior of refrigerator should be cleaned regularly to avoid odor. Please turn off the power before cleaning interior. Remove all foods, drinks, shelves, drawers, etc. Use a soft cloth to clean the inside of the fridge. Do you want to know the ideal temperature for freezer where you can store your food safely and stop bacteria growth and you just can set the temperature to negative 18 degrees Celsius or 0 degree Fahrenheit? Do you want to know what is the ideal temperature for fridge? Fridge should be set between 3 degrees Celsius and 5 degrees Celsius. If any higher or any lower, your food will lose the freshness and nutrients. So that's the storage tips and care for the fridge. And for more details, you can refer to Toshiba Owner's Manual for Energy Saving, uh, Storage Tips and Care and others. And you also can visit Toshiba website.